Hello friend, welcome to my engineering hub. This is your narrator, Chief Engineer Ravi Gupta. Today, we'll talk about the starting of a heavy fuel oil purifier. The method is same for the lube oil purifier and for the other type of purifier. So you should know what action one by one you should perform to ensure that the purifier is started properly. So purifier is an important equipment in onboard and basically the main purpose of purifier is to purify the dirty oil into clean oil what is they are removing they are removing dirt dust and the most important water which are present in a bunker oil the oil which has been purified is basically used for the combustion purpose so the purifier is a very critical important equipment and its correct functioning is topmost priority so let's see the purifier starting procedure friend those who are watching this video i want to tell you either i've make a video regarding the purifier line diagram if you watch that video and then you watch this video you will have a much more clear concept so let's start today video of purifier starting procedure so this is the heavy fuel oil settling tank this is the heavy fuel oil service tank this is the feed pump this is the purifier heater this is the purifier operating water tank this is the fuel oil slush tank and this is the fuel oil purifier so basically whenever the purifier is doing the desludge at that time the sludge is collected here the water for closing opening and for sealing water is provided by this operating water tank so let's see one by one procedure of the purifier starting the first thing you should do is that you have to make sure that the purifier breaker is on and the power is available to the purifier now after that we will open the hydrophore valve so this is the line coming from the hydrophore and from here we will open this valve so if, if you see clearly now we have opened this valve after opening the fresh water filling valve to the operating water tank then now we will open the closing water valve okay so now we have opened the closing water valve now we will open the sealing water valve now we have opened the sealing water valve so what we have done till now so we have opened the water to the purifier first we have opened the water to the operating water tank from the hydrophore it is coming and then we have opened the water for the closing water and the sealing water but we are not providing the water to the purifier it has been provided with the help of this solenoid valve which will get activated automatically we'll see in the upcoming slide and this is the bypass provided in order in case of manual operation this is normally in a set position so we have opened this three valve now we go to the settling tank so now we will open this settling tank so what is the settling tank is doing basically whenever we are taking the bunker the oil from the bunker tank is transferred to the settling tank by the help of a fuel oil transfer pump after the oil is transferred to the hair then it has been provided assist for the purification and then it is collected after purification to the service tank so now the oil is transferred from the transfer pump and it is now around 70 degree celsius now what we will do we will open this valve which is going basically from settling tank to purifier feed pump so here we will open this valve so we have opened the vlsfo settling tank valve to the purifier now after that we will open the feed pump suction and discharge valve now we have opened the suction and discharge valve of the purifier now we will open the service tank valve so if you see clearly here so basically the oil after purification the oil after purification the purifier oil which is coming out from the purifier will be getting collected here okay so this valve need to be open otherwise the oil which is coming out from the purifier will not come to the service tank so we need to open this valve 94 so we have opened this valve now after opening this valve now the purifier is lined up so what we have done till now we have opened the operating water tank 
we have opened the line from the settling tank to the feed pump feed pump suction and discharge valve and the oil which will come out from the purifier to the service tank now we will start the feed pump so we have start the feed pump so if you see clearly now the pressure is zero bar after the feed pump started the pressure is 2.9 bar one more thing you will see that now we will open the steam heater inlet so before it's closed now we have opened the steam heating so as we started the steam heating the before the temperature was 38 now the temperature is 41 it means now the oil temperature is rising so now what we are doing so basically we are taking the oil from settling tank and from here through feed pump we are heating up in the purifier heater and then this is a three-way recirculation valve this light lit mean it is going in this direction and it is going back to the settling tank so one more time i will tell you the oil from the settling tank is coming out from here and then we it is coming out like this and then from the feed pump it is coming out and then it is being heated up and then this light is means that it is a three-way valve and now it is in this direction and it will go back to the settling tank so the now the oil is in recirculation mode the purifier oil is in recirculation mode settling to settling and it will take a time of 15 to 30 minutes so we have lined up the water we have put in the recirculation now we will start the purifier to gain the speed so now we will start the purifier okay now we are starting the purifier and we will put it in a auto mode so one thing you will see here when the purifier started at that time the ampere is 100 amp whenever the purifier is started at that time what will happen the purifier first starting ampere will be very high six times high and after that when it has gained to a rated rpm it will drop to a very much more lower amperage so suppose if the starting ampere is 15 amp then you will see that running ampere may be around 5 to 6 amperage so one more thing you will observe here that while the purifier is started and it is gaining the rpm the oil is slowly slowly coming up it was 44 now it is 63 now it is 72 so the oil is gaining temperature and now you will see as the purifier is gaining speed the ampere is also coming down now here you can see there is too much panel is there one is start one is stop one is auto stop and one is the normal what is this normal this is a normal is basically will get lit up when the correct temperature of the purifier heater will reach what is the correct temperature the correct temperature is around 85 to 95 degree celsius so when the correct temperature will get what will happen now you will see it will get lit up now the temperature was 72 now it is around 89 so it lit up means that now the oil is reached correct temperature we can provide the feed so now one more thing you will observe that before when the purifier was started the ampere was 100 now you please focus on amperage now it is 59 and now it is 20 amperage it means that the purifier has gained its proper speed and is coming to the rated amperage and after the rating ampere here it is 20 ampere now we can start the feed when we press the start feed button what will happen that it will go to the this thing so before the feed is provided some action will happen when you press the feed button what will happen first the closing water will go and it will close the bowl after the bowl is closed now the sealing water will go you can see here the first now this seal closing water is getting activated and this solenoid is activated and from here the water is coming and filling the and closing the thing now the sealing water is getting activated the sealing water you can see here the sealing water is getting activated and the sealing water has been coming inside now the sealing water why we are why you are providing sealing water we are providing sealing water for the interface now the sealing water has filled up properly now after sealing water has filled up and the closing water has closed the bowl now the purifier is ready for the feed 
now you focus here from the three way recirculation it will the direction from the settling tank it will change over to the purifier feed inlet see see this is change one more time you see this is now this and now it is then this direction so basically it is changing from here to here and now it is been feed is given and the purifier oil is now coming inside the purifier means the oil from settling tank is coming which is heated up to correct temperature now it is 98 and it is coming inside the purifier and it is getting inside the purifier now it will fill up the purifier and slowly slowly the back pressure will increase one more important thing when after the purifier you start you have to maintain the back pressure the back pressure you should maintain around 1.5 to 2 bar so from here it will come out like this and now from here it will go to the heavy fuel oil service tank so you have to maintain a back pressure of around 1.5 to 2 bar here we are maintaining 1.8 bar the oil is coming from here heated up and it's going like this and now here it is going and set cut in the service tank so in, in synopsis if you say what we have done first we have opened the water this closing water sealing water and then we have lined up for the recirculation from here we have lined up from recirculation now when the current temperature is reached at that time this normal light will get lit up and in the meantime when the recirculation is happening we will start the purifier we will wait for the rated amperage starting with 100 ampere when it come to 20 ampere at that time we will wait after that when the normal temperature light is lit up at that time we can start the feed when we start the feed the closing water will go we will close the bowl then sealing water will come it will fill the sealing water and after the sealing water is filled up now what will happen then this feed will go from here which going back to the settling tank it will come to the purifier and from purifier the oil will get inside and the clean oil from the center will come out and it will be collected here and then it will go to the service tank you have to maintain a back pressure of 1.5 to 2 bar friend if you have learned something from this video then please to like share and